Hey there guys, what's up? It's your boy Pixel 12 back with another YouTube video for you guys on the channel. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the new 24-7 mode that is dropping in WWE Supercard. So without further ado, I suggest you get right into the video. Right then guys, welcome back to the video. And as you guys can see, we're loading up WWE Supercard right now to see what is installed for us for this 24-7 mode that has dropped. There we go, we got it back. Challenging champion. Challenge. Right, I'm going to give you guys a quick one down on how to play it and then we're going to go into a game and I'm going to talk more about it. So, 24-7 Champion is the is a limited time game mode where you try to earn the title of the 24-7 Champion and keep it as long as possible. Like the, 20, like the WWE 24-7 Championship, once you earn the title, you must defend it from all challenges whenever and wherever they appear. Earning the title, if you think you've got what it takes, tap the challenge button to put your cards where your mouth is. If you win, you'll immediately become the new 24-7 Champion. As a champion, you can go about your normal business, playing other game modes, improving your cards, etc. But always be ready to defend your title because a challenger could appear at any time. Defending the title online. When you're challenged, for the title you'll see a referee slide onto the screen to let you know once that happens you'll only have a few minutes to accept the challenge if you don't show up to defend your title before the time runs out you'll lose it automatically if you win the match you'll retain your title and increase your win streak woo defending the title offline be aware the challenger can also appear while you're not actively playing supercard as long as you have push notifications turned on a message will be sent to your device when you have a challenger there's still a time limit for getting back in the ring but you'll have a much longer grace period if the challenge appears whilst you're offline losing the title if you lose to a challenger or you don't show up to defend your title in time you'll lose it and your win streak will set to zero after losing 24 7 champion title you'll have to wait a little while before you can issue another challenger rewards you'll earn rewards pack after every match regardless of if you win or lose the, con the contents of the pack will vary based on your current win streak as well as the top eight tier good luck Right, so we're going to go through the rewards. So, always goes in tens, but this is where it gets sick. So, win streak zero, five picks. So, one that, once we play this game, we'll have a win streak of one. So, we'll be getting this reward. Ten picks, ten super coins, and five picks. Then, win streak two, anything up to a WrestleMania 38, and ten super coins, and five picks again. Win streak three, same thing, 20 super coins, and five picks, though. So, it increases win streak four. Same thing again, based on the cards, 20 super coins, and five picks. Win streak 5, up to a Ronin, 20 super coins and 5 picks. Win streak 6, again same, uh, up to a Ronin, but it's a female this time. 30 super coins and 5 picks. Win streak 7, equipment, that's very, very good. I like the fact they've included equipment in this, awesome, but it's up to a Ronin equipment, 30 super coins and 5 picks. Win streak 8, up to a SummerSlam BCE card, 30 super coins and an Atom, love that. Win streak 9. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. The John Cena is available through this as well as other special edition cards, including Logan Paul, Liv Morgan, Dominic, Ray, and whatnot. Even the Undertaker special edition card. If you guys didn't manage to get it whilst you're in running here in the pack, you can get it from here as well as Asuka. Then 50 super coins and an Atom. And then for the 10 plus, SummerSlam BCE. Special edition cards, 40 super coins, and an atom. I love this. Great rewards. I love seeing special edition cards. I'll be grinding my ass off on this. I'll be streaming this later on Twitch. But without further ado, let's get right into the gameplay. Right, so this is like a wild game, by the way. So for you guys who don't know what wild is, I mean, what have you you've been hiding under a rock? So basically, your top eight cards will go up against other people's top eight cards or bot account as I'm facing right here. I should win this as it's the first challenger. So we win the first match with Cody, then mail tag, we've got Drew and Damian Priest. Mine's a fort one, so I should win that piece of cake. And then we've got the female match, which obviously two lefties doesn't really help, but they've got two down arrows at the end of the day, weren't ever gonna beat my cards anyway. So now we've got a win streak of one. So we'll have the win streak one reward. As you guys can see, I've already got the belt from when it was last in the game on my account. So win streak of one, claim your reward. There we go, five picks. 10 super coins what will happen now you guys can go about your business play pvp play wild all of a sudden a ref will appear i'm going to play a couple wild games and get right back to you when that appears right then guys as you guys can see hurry to defend your title this is what happens when you get challenged to play the 24 7 mode right so we're now going to jump into it, it gets highlighted here We've got a new challenger view deck we're going to quickly see what our deck is if it's got our best cards in it which it should have this is your top your deck for this game mode tier wise as well we've got three minutes to defend it let's get right into it so we're going to use cody and drew for the tag because cody's a pro so he'll carry me to the win here 63 mil on just one card smokes almost both of his singles then we've got the two Liv morgans should win yeah my Liv morgan wins that perfectly fine and then my tag here should win as well because i've got a pro of jerry the king lawler beautiful done 
So we won again, perfect game. Perfect game part doesn't matter. As long as you win, you've won, you're calm. So we now got a win streak of two. Claim reward, we're ranking up. Better rewards, we get a Valhalla. John Cena, card that I cannot see. Oh, I mean, an image that I cannot see. I saw the card. And then 10 super coins, awesome. So this will keep happening repeatedly and you can go on a, mad, a win streak. I was on a win streak of over 200 last time. The one thing I am a bit sad to see that it's only up for eight days, but it's definitely grindable. So make sure you guys get this because obviously the rewards, as you guys can see, if you get over 10 and get your hands on the Cena card as well as other super cool special editions. If I can get a four, a fortification of Logan, leave. I've already got an F1 Dominic. If I can get the Re Pro Ray, something like that, even the Undertaker just for the image. Awesome, awesome, awesome source. So with that being said... <laughs> This has been your boy Pixel12. If you guys have liked this video, please hit the like button, subscribe if you're ready, and I'll see you guys on the next one very, very soon. Bye!